Oh, hey, hi. I'm Crazy Chris, and welcome to So Cool Science. Science you can do right at home. I'm just hanging out on planet Earth and going over today's science file. How did the Earth form? I get asked that a lot, and my answer is... Try this. You will need a container, some tape, some rocks, and a plastic bag. Okay, first you're going to want to get yourself a container of some sort. Ha ha! Oh. Next, you're going to want to get yourself some pebbles. I know just where to get some, too. Hee hee! Oh, whew! I thought there was something on the bottom of my shoe. The pebbles are right here. Ha ha! Woo! And the final ingredient... A plastic bag. And now, you're ready to construct your model. Now, Take a big rock and place it in the center. And drop it in the center. Whoa! Woo! Center. Make sure that when you drop the rock in, that there's a bit of a well in the plastic. This well is what's called a gravitational well. All right, now get yourself a handful of rocks and start dropping them all the way around the outside of the well. So how is this like the formation of the Earth? Well, take a look at this. Scientists believe that the Earth, Sun, and all the other planets and moons in our solar system formed about 4.6 billion years ago. These all form from a giant cloud of gas and dust known as a solar nebula. Notice how gravity pulls the smaller rocks towards the bigger rock in the center. The Earth formed due to a force of gravity. Small clumps of the rocky material eventually came together with the dust in the original solar nebula to form protoplanets. These protoplanets broke apart, reformed until they became the four inner rocky planets. So, now you know how the Earth was formed. Think of all the awesome things that the Earth has to offer us. Uh, trees, and uh, water, and rocky land, and uh, air. Uh, achoo. Keep in mind that this is the only planet we know of currently that can support life. And that is why science is really, really cool.